Hey guys, it's Story and welcome, welcome. So today's video is going to be a mostly Dollar Tree DIY home decor project because there were some hiccups, but more on that in a bit. For now, here's your sneak peek of what you guys are gonna see. And let's just go ahead and get started. I'm starting out with this round mirror with suction cups that I picked up by the hair accessories in my Dollar Tree and four packages of these metal skewers that I found in the kitchen section. I took my mirror and I gently bent the frame back and then slowly slid my fingers all the way around the edges of the mirror until it came out of the frame. Next, with some wire cutters, I snipped off the pointy end on all of my skewers, then flipped them over and snipped off all of the round hooks. I flipped my mirror over and used E6000 epoxy to attach the skewers to the back of my mirror. I did this for all 16 of my skewers, making sure to space them as evenly as I could, then I let this sit for the epoxy to dry. I was going to use 20 of these compact mirrors from the makeup section of Dollar Tree, and some of these were actually sent to me by Christy Davis. She must have known that I needed more for this DIY and was so sweet to think of me, so a big thank you to Christy. She does some Dollar Tree videos on her channel as well, and I really enjoy the Dollar Tree hauls that she does, so I will link her channel in the description box below for you guys to check out if you'd like to. So here's the situation. I I used a small screwdriver to easily pop out some of the mirrors, but others were a little bit harder. I even tried boiling them, thinking that would weaken the glue, but that wasn't working. After all this hassle, I wondered if I could find some 2-inch mirrors cheaper than 50 cents a piece online, and sure enough, they're on Amazon for $9.99 for a pack of 50. So that's what these are, and I'm using 40 of them. I will put the link to these exact mirrors down below, just in case you're interested. And now that I have my 2-inch mirrors, let's move on. I flipped my skewer mirror over and slid my little mirrors under the skewers facing down. I alternated doing three mirrors on some skewers and then two on the others. On my three mirror skewers, I have the mirrors in one inch from the center and then three and a half inches between here and here. For my two mirror skewers, the mirrors are three and a half inches from the center and from one another. Then I just applied some E6000 on top of the skewers and to the back of the mirrors and then let them sit like this for the epoxy to dry. To hang this piece, I'm going to be using four of these plastic Velcro command strips. I pressed two together and removed one backing and pressed it to my center mirror. I added a second set next to the first ones. Then I went to my wall and removed the other backing from my command strips and pressed my mirror to the wall. And and here's one final shot for you guys of how the project turned out. Well, that's it, and I am kind of glad that this ended up the way that it did because finding the little mirrors online will be cheaper and less work for you guys, so I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I will link here now the playlist to all of my other Dollar Tree DIY home decor projects so you guys can check those out if you'd like to, and as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye!